Try to close out the round, and Libero coming in from behind. He hasn't used the barrage yet this round, but he's going to have a chance right here. Nene wins the Widow 1v1 against Gods, and it's a 6v5 for New York already at the end of this first round. Hongjo Spark trying to hide. Oh, but not well enough as Bebe gets headshot. Nene looking for another one here, and it's pretty much the end of this one. A little bit of cleanup, and even with this sound barrier on Hongjo Spark, they're going to have such a hard time switching it. Adora throws out the, bri the Blizzard, but Libero has got a nano-boosted barrage to try to finish it, staring down the self-destruct, but he's okay. And that's good wrecking ball. As a Minnesotan and a Wisconsinite, it hurts. It, it makes me feel good when Blizzards amount to nothing. But at the same time, oh, it's not a sick sleep dart on Degazi. Holy cow. Wow, from across the map, finding that one right after the, uh, the shadow step there. So you need... Rhea is still not in the mech, though. There's a barrage, Libero. Comes no in, mech. gets two. No mech. That's no right. defense matrix. Everybody dies. No mech. No chance. Nene gets frozen, but he's okay. He just needs to cool down a little bit. Before uh, getting another kill in New York. Switches it back. 92% in counting. Double kill for Mono at the end of that as well. Starting to adapt really well to that wrecking ball, I think. Here comes Gushway. Can he get back into the point? Gets booped away. Can they keep him off? No. They can! Nice plays to zone out Gushway at the very end of that, not even letting Spark contest. Oh, Anti-heal comes in for Spark, so if anyone had been grabbed by that hook, they probably would have gone down pretty quickly. Jonak threatening those bio grenades. There's a hook coming in, but it gets denied again. And now New York going for the capture. They zone uh -oh. out Gushway. Anti-heal, he's definitely going down. He does. And that is exactly what New York was trying to do. They separated the main tank. Anti-heal, no chance to survive. And now New York's gonna get a very, very fast point A. Yeah, they started with a May wall boost for five of their right now for Nene. Rhea gets hit with the anti-heal, has to back off for a second. Yo, Dragon Strike coming through. Are they gonna get anything out of him? The Halt comes in. Nice Halt. Go down, Nene finds him. That's right, Mecha with the kill under Rhea. Heroes killing their counterparts from the New York side of things. There's the amplification matrix down, amping the healing as much as the damage, which is nice. There goes Gushway. Good hook onto him. Sleep Dart misses, but the shots from Jonak don't. And IDK too low to really contest. Nano boost on a door doesn't do a whole lot. And now the Wrecking Ball comes in out of desperation. But it is overtime for New York. Spark have managed to defend it this long. And there's, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, there's only so much you can do. You know, you had that matrix, but that's about it. Another whole hog for Mecco. That's the second of the fight right now. And that should be point B taken eventually. New York gets it, but they do it in overtime. Yeah, they do it in overtime, so they may not see. It's going to be a slower push. They're not going to try the May boost. They're just going to put Godsby on the top here. On the high so oh, nice Godsby. job. Nicely done in the 1v1 against Nene. Good anti-heal on Hongjo, though. They've got the immortality field back just in time, though, to contend with a good hook on the Mecco. And as fast as point A was for New York to take, Hongjo Spark might not be too far behind on their push. No, it doesn't look like they will be, Doha, especially with Godsby. Just popping up there with the storm arrows, taking Nene out. That's right. And they make it look quite easy. That's my favorite. And Matrix. Dragon Strike right through the am amplification matrix on the other side, but doesn't hit anybody. They just boosted Mono out of the Dragon Strike. All right, maybe that helps. <laughs> Meanwhile, Dragon Strike comes through from the New York side of things. Jonak down, and whoa, Libero taken out as well. So Hongjo Spark striking back here. Hey, it's super awkward. Uh, NYXL went NA. two different directions right there, and even though they threw the Blizzard down, there was no follow up, and now Hongjo just gets a free point B. Uh, maybe. I mean, it's just a response to handle now. Maywall used by Adora to try to block people. He's got the Blizzard as well. Make sure it doesn't get countered, but he does take Jonak's head off in the process. And yeah, I think this is going to be a very fast point B for Spark. Certainly is. And they have paved the way to take an easy map to victory. Makes his way back to the point. Dragon Strike is up for Godspeed. He's going to be rejoining his team relatively soon, but Blizzard's going to get thrown out before he gets there. Yeah, oh, hook on to Libero. Oh, and he can't get the Ice Block off in time. Rhea with a big pick there, and that might be the end of it. Blizzard takes out Jonak as well with a bit of help from Bebe. And everybody's storming the point now. Whole Hog will seal the deal, and the Spark overcome the defensive efforts of New York and tie up the series 1-1. Overall, a much better performance from the Spark. Yeah, this is not the attack they were planning here. Nene, like you said, swapping to that Tracer as the desperation sets it for New York. Another blade. Oh, three kills with one swipe. And he goes down, but hey, man, he did his job. That is enough. That is plenty for New York to finally get the payload moving. Well, it took a while, though. That was a, a long and bitter battle for the NYXL. And we're going to take a look at Libero again here.
With that 3K, so he's gonna, how many swipes to take Dash. to get to the center of the Honjo Spark? <laughs> I mean, the knock-up too is so fun. Yep. That's <laughs> while the Hangzhou Spark are otherwise occupied with the front line. Minefield goes down, Nana Boots Late is up. Time. Oh, Put comes in, but he's got the reflect up in time. Cancel it, goes in onto God's beat. There's a kill there. Onto the Mercy Kushway, super low. Probably not gonna be able to survive much longer. There it is. And Libero, again, bailing out his team with the blade. He can't reflect the freeze, though. Or doesn't matter. Oh, maybe it does. <laughs> All right. No, it doesn't. Yeah, it goes down eventually. It's a little bit low on the side of Rhea. Can they capitalize? He's trying to find a way to sneak in there. Ten seconds remaining. They're going to give the Nano Boost anyway. Going forward here. Went up over the Maywall. Now the Sound Barrier comes in for Spark, and the kills are coming in as well. And I don't know if that's going to work out, man. Sorry. You tried. You tried, and that's really all we can ask. Most of New York was already dead, and that's where the push is going to stop. It was, it was all he could do. Play the game! <laughs> it definitely wasn't going to work. No. And from home, Joe Spark already. They're step on the point right now. They've got the shield. Now New York needs to collapse on this. Unless they want to give up a very fast point eight. Godsby Where just was offers himself as a sacrifice. The immortality field did not come in. He's like, I volunteer as tribute. New York more than happy to oblige there. Rio, though, does come in with the double kill. And even though Mecco gets one, it's going to be tough for New York to hold this one. I don't know. Animo does get the res on the Nene, though. So New York not out of it just yet. It's another ice block from Adora. Kushway a little bit low. Can they finish him? Nene down, baby, fragging out on that Zenyatta. And can they finish off the point right here? He's got the transcendence. It's looking pretty good for Spark. And there goes Animo. So it looks like they will, off of the back of a Godsby 3K, get the point going. I really minutes. Yeah, a little under left. For the spark. Wow, and we're two and tetris now, I guess. Ball on top of wall. Mighty game mortality field down. And here's Rio walking forward with that whole hog. Ushway manages to kill a couple small things, but here comes the dragon strike from New York. Gonna force the transcendence out of Bebe. And now Godsby walking forward with that storm arrow. Mecco down already. Ushway takes out Nana or Menno, and that is the end of the map. New York! They don't even step on it. Alright. Hongjo Spark. Of the Hongjo Spark. Dora's gonna be reflecting those May right clicks. Mecco's just gonna kill Bebe, I guess. New York pushing forward at the 6 feet 5 now. No res. Oh boy. Kushway fortified, trapped behind the wall, tries to walk away. He's in trouble though, and he goes down. There's a res. So IDK using it. And there's a hook on Aria right away though, so the D mech is gonna come in. And IDK down already, so this defense instantly collapsing for the Hongjo Spark. Again, I, I just question what the Genji is supposed to do there. Uh, they did stop the payload for a brief moment with that Nano Blade, but I think definitely the swap over is the smart way to play this one. Yep. They're gonna try and get an early jump on the Bay Reaper, which we'll almost Ooh. certainly see here in point C. And then a very confident that that would drop down below the head. Right, not a long cooldown on that one, but time to engage should have it up again. Blizzard now coming here for Libero. Can they close it out? Nice halt, bringing them together. As the attacking team, you just throw it in. Here's the payload as you get to the end of it. Nobody really gets stuck in that one, but it does zone them away. Now Spark collapsing again as the Blizzard ends. Gosby trying to walk the back lines. Nene gets four! Whoa, there's your play of the game right there. And that should be the end of that. Well, New York. there was a D-back onto Rhea, and what happened is the Hongjo Sparks shield early, but they've been able to keep him alive. Now Mecco gets frozen. Libero getting really close to a Blizzard as well. There goes Imar DLT Field, and now Pebe striking back with a kill onto Mecco. Oh, the Trance just a little bit Man. late to save Libero right there. Animo trying to come back with an elimination onto Godsby. It's very rough. They get a, they get the, the res, res, but... Uh -oh. uh, Supports are dead. It's only... Uh, all right, well, Libero just gets to die again. Yep. Cryogenically frozen until <laughs> hopping out into a Roadhog. <laughs> they most likely are not going to be able to win this fight. Now they've got the Coalescence. It's going to be Jonak from behind using that Moira ultimate. Wall comes in, blocks a little bit of that healing. Bebe with the kill on the Mono. They couldn't quite get the healing onto him in time. Nene does get the kill on the Bebe in his same. And Adora able to take down Mecco's mech with that Blizzard. Godsby gets a couple as well. And oh dear. Oh, oh. Stall? Stall much? Yep. Nicely done. On the Animo. Payload itself getting a bit stalled too, and once again, <laughs> Libero is gonna be like, well.
right. Otherwise, we're going to go to Time Bank here on Junkertown. Halt yep. goes out. Are they going to get anything? They're going to fling an ice block fade to the other side. That's what happens if the Halt gets stopped in and comes in with the Death Blossom and kill on the IDK already. But he goes down. Hongjo Spark answering, but they got hit with a big bio grenade. Does it matter? I don't know. They're almost there. It's only Chodak on the point right now. But here comes Animo trying to boot people away, but there's only so much a couple yeah, supports can do. And it looks like we are going to go to the time bank round. They're going to have that shield for a bit longer than New York will. There's the Death Blossom here. Libero dodges it with the Ice Block. Mono loses a supercharger in the meantime here. Comes a Blizzard from the Hongjo Spark. Get a freeze up Libero. Nene gets two, though, on the Reaper. Godspeed striking back. And there's one on the Mono from the Self Destruct. So will the Spark be able to win this shorthanded fight here? Not a lot of people left. And with a 4v2, I don't think it's going to work out. Nene <laughs> says no, and that's where the payload stops. New York gives up some ground, but not much. Nene here. He's on the flank. He's going to try and get to oh, him. Oh, Bebe. Bebe, rather, he gets him. Huge pick from Nene. That is absolutely massive that he was able to go in there and get that one onto the Zenyatta. Here comes the Blizzard, though. Oh, but Nene dropped back in with a 2K Death Blossom. And New York really seems like they're ready to send us to map five. Called it from the beginning, man. Here we go. That's a win for New York. And we're going to go to the tiebreaker. Really good setup there from Nene. They're going to get the Reaper in. Now they have a Blizzard. Wraith form out. So there's a chance here they could come back in. No. Gonna get somebody else on there, though. And ooh, oh. barely. Adora gets there just in time. Supercharger now for the Spark. But everybody going down on that side. New York already way ahead numbers wise. And it's only a matter of time, it seems like. Unless Adora just totally carries this one, and he's not going to be able to do that. No, he's not. Just a mini Diva and a Lucio left, and that'll seal the deal eventually for NYXL's victory. Yep, so New York, it's a fight, but they take point A, or the first point, rather, here on Lijiang Tower. Now looking for that opening. Can't get chunked down too much here by the Zenyatta from Jonak. That coalescence comes in from Hongjo Spark. Jonak responds with the transcendence as his team jumps onto the enemy. Gushui down already. They've got the sound barrier timed perfectly as the transcendence ends. And flawless execution that last fight. Despite losing mono, that is what you want to do. A New York Excelsior has punched their ticket to a win here against Hongjo Spark. Getting it done in map five. Great job from the NYXL, keeping them in contention for that number one seed coming through in the end.